Hey everybody, so I have another Bible review for you uh, that you are going to love. I think I say that about all the Bibles that I review. But I really don't review a Bible unless I really do like it. Uh, because I'm not going to share something with you that I don't love. I'm just not going to do it. Uh, because I feel like it's a waste of your time and mine. But I do want to share this Bible with you. This is new to me. It is not a brand new Bible. Um, it has been a, around for some time, but since I started seminary uh, earlier in the fall, I'm totally geeking out over this Bible. I really am. And if you're a little theologically nerdy like me, then you really are going to want to have this Bible. It's a great resource. I do think you can also get it digitally. Um, if you don't want to have a ton of Bibles in the house or if your husband's like mine and gets a little frustrated with the amount of Bibles that you have, it's fine. But, um, I do think that you can get the digital version of this as well. So you have access to the notes. Obviously the scripture is the same. The notes are really what set it apart. So this is the systematic theology study Bible. She's beautiful. I'm just going to say she's really beautiful. It comes in this box. Uh, I got the True Tone Brown. And I think they have it in black and other styles as well. But she is lovely. She's truly lovely. So I'm going to walk you through the inside of this Bible, what it includes, what it looks like. I'm going to let you get up close to the text so you can see uh, how big the font is, as well as all of the wonderful theological information that she holds. So I'm going to show you the inside of this Bible. You need this. You want this. You might want to gift this to someone in your life who is theologically nerdy because they would really enjoy this Bible. It's not super big, um, surprisingly enough. It's really not, um, compared to my face. Um, it's not a super big Bible. It's not super bulky. So it would be a good one for church. It would be good for just everyday study. Uh, so I'm gonna let you see the inside and I will put a link in the comments below so that you can check out and grab this Bible for yourself. All right, so we are going to flip through the inside of the Systematic Theology Study Bible. Again, this is from uh, ESV, and it does, it depending on what style you get, this is the, the leather feel cover, uh, but it does include the places for, you know, your name, births, adoptions, marriages, deaths, uh, but this, I want to show you the inside of this Bible and why I think it is um, a great Bible to have and it would make a great gift for someone. Uh, obviously, you're going to see the introduction to the to the study Bible, why it matters, uh, what they've included, why they've included it, uh, the contributors to the ESV. You're going to get a lot of the preface materials. Um, but I want to really dig into what is inside of this Bible. So for each book of the Bible, you will see an introduction to the book. You're going to get uh, the background, the context, who it was written by, when it was written, who it was written to. And then you're going to get into the theological message. And this is really important as we study scripture because we re we know that uh, it's not just bits and pieces put together, but that it is one overall story of God's redemption that all come together. All of these pieces from Genesis to Revelation, they work together. And so this Bible is going to focus specifically on that systematic uh, theology, the way things are divided in scripture, grouped together together. Um, Christology, soteriology, soteriology uh, ecclesiology, um, all of these different things, you're going to dig into those with the study Bible. And so this is going to see, to show you what the theological message is of each book of the Bible, such as Genesis, which is what we're in right now. Um, and then it's going to give you an outline of 
what Genesis includes from creation to the family of Adam, to the story of Noah, uh, the family of Esau, the family of Jacob. We're going to see how this outline builds together and how God is using it uh, to create and to show his love for his people and his redemption for his people. So this Bible does include um, cross-reference verses and it also, it's a, of course, a double column Bible. It does not give you a lot of margin space. It's focusing more on uh, the notes and the passages rather than giving you space to kind of work through the text. Uh, but as you can see here, this is where we get into these uh, systematic theology pieces, mankind and the study of man. And so we see that man is made in the image of God and you get a, a breakdown of the text. You get theology for life. You also get the, cre the cultural creation mandate, uh, what God commanded of man. And so it breaks down those theological pieces for us. Uh, mankind, sin, uh, we see the different doctrines and theologies uh, that are woven throughout scripture. We also see that it illuminates Jesus throughout the entire Bible. In the Old Testament, where we see uh, Christ come into the picture, uh, we it gives you study notes and it really helps you dig into those places in Scripture where we may not uh, think about those things or we may not necessarily catch it. Um, this Bible is really going to help us unpack all of that. So the other part of this Bible that I greatly appreciate is that it has a very large section of articles in the back uh, of the Bible. So it's talking about reading the Bible theologically um, and how we can be better at doing that and how we can study our Bible rightly. Uh, and it goes into other articles about uh, creation, revelation, salvation, scripture, uh, we really are going to dig into all of these theological topics in this Bible. And I think that's what makes it so very helpful as we're studying. We're not just reading, but we are really digging into the truth of who God is and what he is doing through his creation to bring glory to himself. And so this is a great resource. If if you know someone or you yourself are really interested in um, digging deeply into scripture and studying these theological topics, this is such a great Bible to have on hand to help you do that. It helps you get sight of what's really important as we are studying scripture. So in the back, it also includes a index of sidebars. So this is each of the set of notes that you'll find uh, throughout the scriptures. So if there's something specific that you were looking for, whether it's an attribute of God, the Christian life, salvation, uh, you can quickly go through the index and find where those are throughout this Bible. It also includes a sidebar of themes. So themes that you see throughout scripture, atonement, adoption, apostles, um, even going into, uh, if I can get there, going through um, disobedience, desiring God, all of those pieces, you'll see the scripture references for them, as well as a regular concordance in the back of this Bible as well. So it's going to include all of the scripture references based on the topics and words within scripture. And so you have a pretty, a pretty large concordance in this Bible, which is extremely helpful. And it's probably one of the larger ones um, that I have seen out of, of many, many Bibles. I mean, you're looking at um, well over 100 pages uh, of concordance notes in here as well. So one thing I want to make sure we note before we finish this review is font size. This is a question that I get asked a lot, and uh, I think it's important to know the font size of the Bible when you buy it, especially as we get older and we don't want to have to work as hard to read and see. Uh, this is a, a prob I'd probably say an 11-point font. It's not super small, um, but it is not 
super large either. So it is not a large print Bible, but it is more of a comfort print. Um, so it's going to be a little bit easier to read than some of the other Bibles that I've shown before that have extremely tiny print. Uh, so I would say this is probably a 10 to an 11 point font. All right, so that was the inside of the Systematic Theology Study Bible. Uh, I think you'll love it. I really do, because I love it. And I'm, I, I don't just say that because I love all of my Bibles, but I'm saying this is going to be really great as you study. and It's really going to aid you in getting deep into those theological topics that maybe we don't always dig into as we study scripture. So this is going to be a great Bible. Uh, Christmas is coming. And this might be for someone on your Christmas gift list. So in the comments below, you can grab a copy of this Bible uh, through Amazon. It's on Christian Book. You can grab it straight from Crossway. So I will link all of those in the description box below. You can check out all of our other Bible reviews. If there is a different Bible that you were looking for, you can check all of those out uh, on our YouTube channel under the reviews playlist. And you can see all of the Bibles that uh, I have shared that I love and I think are great resources to have. And check it out. See which Bible might be the best one for you. So until next time, I'll see you later.